Waiting for Ben Feldman, connecting. Hey! How's it going? Happy quarantine, Lore. I haven't seen you in forever. I know, I know. How has that been going, by the way? We have a lot of booze. Now, I think you'll appreciate this. I was out doing a a, a run, like a grocery run, which we, we all still have to do. We have to buy groceries. And I was stocking up on Prosecco, and a, oh. another customer accused me of hoarding booze. <laughs> And this was like, what, three, four months ago? <laughs> well, this is the thing. I was buying like 12 bottles. Your average like, well, some of us Prosecco. aren't hoarding all the Prosecco. And I was like, this is what I would normally buy. That's, that's perfectly reasonable. That's, it's that's nice. reasonable. There is a fan base of ours who yeah. are very passionate about the Samosa relationship. Yes. Okay. I'm not saying this weird thing. Is, that, is this about make Ben say the thing? I'm getting like probably a hundred tweets a day about it. A lot of what's been commented here, they're just asking that you say, I stand Samosa, that's it. Yeah, and what's so funny is, I don't have any problem with that. I just feel like I'm digging in on this one and I'm just saying like, you, can't, you don't own me, you can't control me. I'm not saying that. <laughs> <laughs> I came up with some trivia questions about Superstore uh, to see if I can stump you. Okay. Okay. I, I don't, I'm not, I don't, I wouldn't root for me, anyone watching this because I, I'm not good with trivia and I, and I get nervous and I forget everything. This is the Lauren Ash trying to stump Ben Feldman trivia. Five questions. Okay. All right. Number one, what was Amy's name tag in the pilot? Now, people watching, don't type it in. Don't help him. Let him try and get it on his own. Oh, man. I hadn't even thought about that. That would have been awesome if I... Amy's name tag... Oh, gosh. I didn't even, like... I called her by it, didn't I? I think you do call her by the name. Yes, you do, at the end. And then she says her real name. If you want clues, also... Yes, I'd I love can... a clue. I'd love a clue. Clues are fun. Okay. This is the name of a very famous... Uh, character in a series of children's books written by Beverly Cleary. Oh, I don't know names of authors. I, I, I give up. Steve? The name, the answer is Ramona. Ramona! Ramona. Oh, I, yeah, I, that's, no. No, don't okay. remember it. Well, listen, God bless. Okay. okay, question two. What did Dina say to Jonah after she kissed him for the first time in the change room. What did Dina say to Jonah after she kissed him for the first time in the change room? Uh, I stand Samosa. <laughs> <laughs> You've just given them what they want, you know. They just want to be able to have the sound bite. You're welcome, you psychos. Because <laughs> uh, you remember the scene, of course, you were like, I don't know how to tell you I'm not interested. You did not tell me that you weren't interested. Teeth? Was it something about teeth? Yes. So, soft, soft teeth? <laughs> something about, something about teeth. I should get some credit for this. You do get credit for that. The, the line was, your teeth taste so good. Your teeth taste so good. I feel like there might've been a an alt where my teeth were soft or something like that. Or maybe I'm sure a, that's I, possible. Absolutely. You know what? I'm gonna give you a point for that because you got that it was about teeth. But, but stunned that I remember something like that. And All right, question three. In episode 320, Gender Reveal, written by Lauren Ash, <laughs> what famous movie has Jonah never seen? What famous movie has Jonah never seen? Um, was I in the scene? Yes, so to give you, I'll give you a little bit of context. Okay. Okay. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. The, the, the storyline was you and Mateo. Uh huh. And you were trying, you were playing good cop, bad cop about Jeff because Jeff had been lying about working at Target. Right. You and Mateo have a conversation. He references a movie and then you reveal that you've never seen it. Um, it was like a really popular, like a movie that everybody's seen. A classic. But here's another hint. So, so Mateo's saying, um, you know, because you're basically saying to Mateo, it's like, you're such a good actor. And he says something about, an, uh, you know, have you seen blank? That character didn't actually have cancer. 
Uh, Toy Story. The answer is Terms of Endearment. Terms of Endearment. I don't remember that. I don't remember it at all. Four. How many birds did Dina have before they were set free? This is a well, question from this 17. season. 17. Final answer? It's 12 or 17. 17. You're so close. It's 16. <sighs> all right. Final question. Okay. In All Nighter, what two songs does Cheyenne dance to? Uh, oh, uh, Eternal Flame? Was that one of them? Are you just not going to answer? No, I'm waiting for you to give me your answer. Because there was something like slow and romantic, and then there was something that was ridiculous. Yes. Ah. Uh, I don't, was it like that Barbie song? I'm gonna say, <laughs> I feel like that's wrong. But in my head, as I remember it, there was Eternal Flame and that Barbie song that I don't know the name of. You're very close. So the first okay. song was True Colors by Cindy Lauper. Hi, Cindy Lauper. Yeah. And then the second song, this was a bit of a trick question because it's Anaconda by Nicki Minaj, but it's the actual part they used was a sample of I Like Big Butts. Oh, uh, yeah. See, I knew same kind of era. Like, I knew it was... Okay. All right. So what do I get? Do, did I win? Well, you got one out of four, and that point cool. was a pity point. <laughs> 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 but I thought you were a great sport, and you did great. Thank, thanks so much. Thanks. I appreciate it. I like um, that people are commenting, Ben, you need to watch your own show. Have you ever seen an episode of the show? I mean, this is just giving more fodder to the, yeah. to the people. Yeah. All right, so people, we're turning it over to you, the people. Do you have questions for Ben Feldman? Do you have questions for me about Ben Feldman? Uh, is there a way that you want to rip on Ben Feldman that maybe we haven't explored yet? What do you think Jonah's karaoke song would be? Jonah, so it'd have to be like embarrassing, kind of esoteric and obnoxious. I don't know, like maybe like a like a talking head song. No, oh. no. <laughs> Totally. Like, okay. or like, or it would be like, or like John Denver. Yeah, well, yeah, or like, or if he thought he was being like, like he was making a statement, like an Indigo Girls song or something. Lauren, Lauren Ash, what is your? You are a giant karaoke fan. What yeah. is your go-to if you only have one? Because you my... do twenty in a night. I try super... to not wear out my welcome, but. If I can only have one, it's Blaze of Glory by John Bon Jovi. It like, it sits in a nice place in the yeah. range. Yeah. All right, All right. guys, um, we need one more good question. Okay, Ben, if you could play any other character on Superstore, who would it be? Oh, man. I mean, my brain went to Brett right away. <laughs> just, you know. Yeah. It's just such a quiet existence. Um, or Colton, I mean, Garrett, just cause I like being, Garrett gets, Garrett gets to be sort of a voice of reason, but has more jokes than like Jonah, like Jonah. Yeah. I like being still grounded in what are all these lunatics doing around me, but, but, but with the jokes. So I like the, I like the Garrett character a lot. But thank live. you so much for being on Live with Lauren, which we just really got today. I love this show. I love your studio. It's beautiful. Um, thank you so much. It's just really, yeah, everybody's really welcoming here. Your staff, every, thank you so much for having me on. And I'd love to come back uh, whenever, whenever. Well, we'd love to have you, but not until after America Ferrera has come on. So right. have your publicist call <laughs> us. See what me. we can do. <laughs> That's what every talk show says. Yeah, I get it. <laughs> All jokes um, aside, uh, it was good to see you. I haven't seen you in forever. It was nice to talk. You too. We should do this not in front of uh, these people sometime. Absolutely. Let's, let's get a drink sometime. <laughs> it would be the same conversation. Exactly the same. <laughs>